Odie Log Sports Info here, back with another vid for you guys. Yeah, y'all hit that subscribe button, hit that bell icon so y'all can be notified of this real because y'all know Odie Log keeps it real. So let's get into this vid. Let's get into this vid. So today is a good day. It's a very good day. It's a good day for my little homie, Brandon the Cannon Adams, right? Because according to this um, tweet and according to Brandon the Cannon Adams, right? Because I called him, I hit him up, and he confirmed everything that's in this tweet, right? So it's looking like that my little homie is going to take on either Triple G or Jamal Charlo. And I can't wait, y'all. <laughs> I cannot fucking wait. I cannot wait. He's been waiting on this opportunity. For real. Because if y'all don't know, my little homie, he was out of the game for like two and a half, three years, right? Because he lost his last fight and, you know, in the politics of boxing. The politics of boxing kept him out of boxing for three years. Three years, three long, tough years, right? He could have fell off. He could have started smoking and drinking, right, and hanging out and chilling, but what did he do? He stayed focused. He stayed focused. He stayed in the gym. He stayed training, right? And then he got the opportunity to fight on contender. And he fought on contender and he won, right? And this is the fruits of that. This is the fruits of his labor. This is what he's getting out of that, right? He's getting a fight with Triple G or Jamal Charlo. And if he wins either one of those fights, right, he's going to be a star. He's going to be a star. For real, he's going to be a star if he wins one of those fights. He's going to be a star. So, shout out to my little homie. Congratulations, man. Keep it up. Keep pushing. I got your back. Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh-huh.